fighters both with a genuine belief that they can leave with the British title. Win over reach. You, you know what he's going to get with Gavin Gwynn. Oh, it's good, lovely work there from Willis. He knows he's going to get with Gavin Gwynn. Different direction to, to get that left hand into place. So we can, oh, good left hand again. Right talk. Long and lean Willis. 5-7. Using the feet, the good footwork to get out of the way. And again, you know, we thought you know, his feet are going to slow down. He's going to hold his feet and work away. Isn't it for a man with the obvious weapons that he's got at six feet tall? Yeah, but he wants to use that direction. That'll cause Quinn plenty of problems. That's a good jab there. Able to dance away from Gavin Quinn, isn't it? Yeah, they can really sharp and silly rounds here. But now they come for round two then. See, I've got to say, when you're a boxer, that's all I care about. More nice foot movement there, a little pivot away from Luke Willis. To and he's straight on the back foot, nice short uppercut there from Willis as well. That's good from Gwyn there, just making Willis look for the target, not making not an easy, easy target. Now good shot, and again. That's good work though from Gwyn, that's what he needs. And a good jab, he didn't say anything to Willis. From Willis. Again. The to exploit that. But with a flat defence like, like Gwyn has, which is hands high, elbows tucked in nice and tight, which is what he wants. And anything that Gwyn's a little bit slow with, so if he's a bit sloppy with that lead right hook. It's comfortable there, man, doesn't he? Mm. The right hook to the body. Both men seem pretty. Willis, up to this point, he is going. Nice counter there, left hand there from Willis. Ooh. Heads clashing there again. Good yeah. right hand. Yeah, Luke Willis managed to get the left off the back of it. And then he came back with that right hook, but then paid back there by Green. <laughs> So he gets lands with a jab and then Willis another one of those shots but throws the well judging by the smile Gavin Gwynn a better round for Gwynn but I do like those short little hooks that Willis throws and he usually lands with them just to remember that's nice for moving the body doesn't move it's still there to be hit oh, lovely work from Willis lovely Doubles up on the left hook this time. One high, one low for Gwyn. So clean, he just looks so comfortable throwing from all angles. And Gwyn. Gwyn let his hands go there, Gwyn, wasn't he? Look at that physical strength there from Gwyn. Another bit of work done by both corners for a bit of swelling. So from Willis. Just one two on the counter and then Gwyn gets caught with two after but I think his, his shot was probably the cleaner. Willis there trying to tie tie Gwyn up. And he's in close. Both trying to work the body in close there to try to get that right in the solar plexus the pair of at the same time. <laughs> Look at the referee there. Good body shot and a right hand. Head movement there from Willis to make Gwyn miss, but Gwyn keeps coming forward. Here we go, round six. Oh, shot there from Gwyn. As soon as his feet in the wrong place, they be able to get it off. Oh, That's nice from Willis there. Yeah, two in the head as well, a bit, he got away with it. And Willis on the ropes here. He needs to try and find some of that movement. One of those. It's off the ropes. Well, and again. Again. <laughs> again. And Gwyn did well to catch Willis on the move. <laughs> Willis comes back with a clean shot. Left hook there from Gwyn. Yeah. Willis looks up and gets tagged by Gavin Gwyn. And then Gwyn is always on top. He was always looking to land the shot.
I felt the geek there from Willis. Patton continues. Quinn gets in close. Willis dances away. That's a nice shot. Ended on top of the right foot. Yeah, but the thing is, he's stepping inside. He's stepping inside the, inside the feet. Oh, good shot back there from Quinn. Though. For these men, like to stay out of range for long. Forward. Uppercut again from Luke Willis. It is pinpoint. Win. Yeah, clean work, wasn't it? Well, it's lovely work. <laughs> Modus operandi in his professional career, isn't it? Keeps coming, grinds. You just got to be careful, Willis, there. In some of the quiet moments, when he's in field. That's good work over there from Willis. Still from Luke Willis. Oh, <laughs> Look at the response there, it's a jab though. Oh, throws the left, but the response just keeps coming. But he lands with a good shot then, Willis. Well, Luke Willis drops the gloves and dances around and then... Oh, good right hand there from Gwyn, off the ropes. Round nine, nice jab there. For a shot. Win. Still a lot of the psychological. Yep. The jab there from right hand off the back of the jab. Oh, just misses. Got a turn. Oh, good luck to get there from the list, but good left hook earlier on. Catch him and fill it and keep him in a corner. But hard to catch him. On the, on the announcer's thing there, it's a British title fight with 12 rounds. There from Gavin Quinn. And then the 1 2 as well. Finish line, though, round 11 maybe. No, no, well, especially that you can see the finishing line, you can sort of break your teeth. But, box, uh, yeah. Oh, he boxes beautifully, but again. Good shot there from Quinn, good right hand. Get your mind back. Something with Carl Fail as well. Smiling. Oh, Willis got some lovely skills. Really good vision and timing. Could be the difference between leaving as a British and Commonwealth. Until firework, if you like, and then you want to throw again. It gives you a bit more energy from somewhere. That neutral corner then lands a right hand. There's a straight right. Willis just going to be slightly heavier as well, to be honest. Right, round 11. The penultimate. Luke Willis still full of movement in the legs, but Gavin Gwynn. Just like. Oh, the exchange hooks there. Willis landed first. Now oh, lead right that time from Gwynn's a nice shot. And then follows with an uppercut and a hook as well. Leaning on that back foot again. Then. But he's spanning there, Willis, and that was his chance to go. Gwynn. Nothing's heavy landing from him, but he's scoring shots every time. Does he need to grab this by the scrusses with the left hook? Because Willis has jabbed him and then ghosted away. Final round. Quinn can win this consistently. Bit from Quinn though, solid right hand there from Gavin Gwynn. Yeah, and then Willis just steps in with that change. No, quite remarkable, really. Oh, shot yeah. though from Willis to the fight. Oh, good shot there from, from Willis, and again. No, oh, and another right hook. It was off the back of a lazy hook, but it was a piston like right there, and a left oh, hook from right Willis. Done well in this John Willis. Yeah, it's been high tempo for the entire 12. Bring it for the rafters. Oh, did Gavin Gwynn look hurt in the final seconds of the British title? Or has Luke Willis travelled to London? Luke Willis just really tricky, clever.
constant movement stages, even though but then as the rounds went on, I think Gavin just constantly worked there with Nicklin, but for me, maybe Quinn has just done enough. Well, thank you. At the 12 great rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards. Judge Michael Gavin! Yeah,